Hello viewers, I am Will Keith, and I'm here today to show you something new I got with my uh, Patreon money. And as you know, I always try to use that money to help improve my channel. And I've needed a new piece of equipment for a, a long time now. I technically already had one, but it was falling apart. It had huge issues. And I'm going to demonstrate that now. This is my old tripod. This little twiggy alien bastard here that I've been using. And if you put a phone in it, it's totally limp. Like if I move this way a little bit, that's going to rotate like this. If just flip flops, and I used to have it tied down with paracord, but then it was yanking it at an angle down this way, and just generally it's falling apart. It doesn't close up any more than this because, like, most of the, the, the legs are all fucked up. When you extend it, they're like really wobbly, and it's just, it's, it's a mess. I've had this thing for like 10 years now, and it's uh, definitely not, uh, not as good as it used to be. So I'm taking the uh, phone attachment off and I'm going to set this here. This is my new tripod. Look at the uh, just kind of difference in weightiness of these two things. And I got to tell you guys, this thing is fucking incredible. It does everything and more than I could want it, that I could ever need a tripod to do. Uh, you just open it by putting these pegs here, not pegs, but these little flaps as opposed to those stupid pinch buttons on the other one. And the legs extend pretty far. So I'm just gonna pop all of these open real quick. Very, very easy to handle. You can lock them in any position you want. So if you only want one open or you want it open a little, only a little bit, and it has the uh, brace in the middle here to stop it from tipping over. Tipping over with my old one was a huge problem and that is totally stable. The uh, bottom of the feet swivel, so you can put them at whatever angle you need them to be. And that is fucking stable. And now this just goes up and down like so. And you can just screw that in to keep it steady. And now, if you want to attach something to it very solidly, you can pull this lever here and the uh, attachment bit slides off. So I can just put that on like so and screw from the underside. And that is very solidly attached. And that can just slide right back in here. Um, right back in here, yes. I just got it so I'm not totally used to using it yet. So you take the uh, phone and that goes right in there all nice and secure. It's not going anywhere. And uh, you might notice this is like chest level here. Uh, my old tripod, full extension on my old tripod is about even, a tiny bit lower. And I've always thought that was a bit low. So this thing uh, I should mention this is a, uh, a Vivitar 57 inch tripod, they call it. Uh, if you look on Amazon, you'll probably be able to find this exact one. I got this on Staples personally. But if you need it higher, you have this little fishing reel type device. You do this and you just reel and look how fucking high up it goes. That is head level with me, the camera now. And then you just lock that. That doesn't go in by itself. I'm pushing on it pretty good. Uh, if I push really good, it'll go in by itself, but it's not gonna, it's not just gonna slide in there on its own. And I don't know if you can lock it by doing this. Oh, tightening, tightening this thing there. That locks it, all right, I got it. Like I said, I just got this, so I don't know exactly how it works yet. So I'm just gonna reel that back in. If, um, for some reason you need to put it in an angle, you can just unscrew this and lock it in any position you want, like so. It's got fucking levels on it so you know it's stable. And again, I'm just kind of nerding out over this thing because I really, really love this after having such a shit tripod for so long. It's uh, got a handle right here, so if you want to kind of like do selfie stick thing as you're walking, it uh, can kind of, 
the uh, the weight of the legs kind of keeps it stabilized. You know what I mean? If you if you've ever tried to film from a tripod, like I'm walking every which way, and this thing isn't really bouncing around very much at all. So this thing, goddamn amazing. So I'm gonna set you down here, and I also got something else, something I've needed. Huh? Uh, I've only really needed these recently when I uh, got my metal detector. You might have seen the last video I made was the uh, metal detector vlog. And um, these are definitely really going to help. And so I got something else for you right here. Knee pads. This is going to be uh, so much easier for digging. Like I can really just drop down like that. Absolutely no, no pain on the knee there. No digging into gravel or anything. Got one on each leg so I can very easily kneel and dig as much as I need to. So um, I am started out. I got a lot of stuff that I've been needing to kind of make uh, make filming easier and I am very excited to have this shit. Now again, like I make, like I say in basically every video I've made recently, I do apologize for not making any cutting videos recently. It's just been like so insanely fucking hot out here. It's even like so hot today. But now that I got this tripod, I know I'm gonna have to be using it. So expect cutting videos very soon, like tomorrow or maybe the day after, but it's gonna get done in a immediate fashion. So, um, I guess that's about the end of this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. End video.